It is the first time this year that the federal government and labor leaders are meeting to continue discussions on the agitations arising from the increase in the price of petrol and electricity in November last year. With the arrival of representatives of the federal government, the meeting went into the business of the day, which is the presentation of reports from the Technical Committee on Premium Motor Spirit and that on electricity tariffs. While the Committee on Electricity Tariffs says their work is still ongoing, the chairman of the Committee on Premium Motor Spirit summarizes his report, highlighting areas where the government need to work on to reduce the cost of petrol. MPA Massa Charges. Government to enforce immediate collection of MPA and the Massa Charges in Naira to reduce pressure on forex demand and pump price hike. The meeting then went behind closed doors to consider the report presented. About three hours later, both the Minister of Labour and the NLC President briefed journalists about the decision on the report. We received the report and adopted the report. So Labour asked for some time to go and subject uh, the report to their various organs. We accepted the report as a working document. And you know in a committee work, usually you accept the report first even before you read through. So we have gone through the report and uh, we found out that uh, there are some elements in the report that uh, certainly we need to interrogate the report very well. Meanwhile, the Minister of State for Petroleum is raising concerns about the possible effect that the three-week postponement of this meeting could have on the availability of petroleum products. Uh, NMPC has taken some heat because of these discussions that are ongoing. So I'm beginning to wonder if NMPC can continue uh, to take that heat within these three weeks uh, that we have taken. Um, so I'm worried. Frankly, I have not consulted with the GMD of NMPC, but I'll be very surprised if we, will, we do not see some scarcity within this period of 21 days. The federal government had in November last year raised the depot price of petrol from 147 naira 67 kaba to 155 naira 17 kaba per litre, forcing marketers to sell between 165 and 173 naira per litre. Even though the government announced a 5 naira reduction in December last year, Nigerians continue to bear the burden of this price hike.